Hey, how's it going, everyone? Welcome back to some more RimWorld. Last episode, we got three people fall in quick succession, like within an hour or two. It was really weird. And they're all chilling in here. They have beer. Why do they have beer? Um, are you a, are you a nudist as well? You are not. You are, and you are. Yeah, do you have clothes on? No. Okay, good. Alright, mental break, hide in room. Why? Why? What happened? You were fine. What happened? I got, I got... Oh, wow. You just barely broke through that little minor break threshold. You keep getting rebuffed because you keep asking her to, like, do stuff, and nobody nobody cares. They, they don't want to do stuff. Can you please stop doing that? Leave Marina alone. Quit advancing on her all the time. She's busy building batteries. Can you build batteries? Can you build solar panels? She's like a huge credit to this place. And she doesn't like your advancements and you just need to stop. You can go hide in your room and cry about it. Stop it. <laughs> stop doing that. Look at all this corn. Lots of corn. At least you didn't go berserk. If you went berserk, then that'd be a problem. Texane, you're you're valuable part of this too. But seriously, man. Like, you have a lot of good skills. And you can do everything. So you're, you're definitely a valuable credit to this team, but you need to stop being such a pain in the ass to Marina. That's just the facts. Deal with it. We'll go three times speed now. At some point, you're going to need to go to bed, too. You should probably go to sleep. Sad thoughts. Eight without table. We're getting there, man. We're getting there. In fact, now I can build tables. So let's go ahead and do that. Build some small tables. We'll put them... Right here, we'll just build two for now. That way we don't go crazy with trying to build tables. Build some dining tables around it. There, that's more than enough space for now. For seating, rather. Um, and then chop some wood. Make sure we have plenty of wood. Seems like we're doing really well on that. Wouldn't be a terrible idea to find some place to do like, um, Oh, an orchard, like not necessarily an orchard for like food, um, just for, for trees. What would that be? An arboretum. <laughs> I think that's the name of him. <laughs> I'm pretty sure it's an arboretum. All right, this will be for trees. Don't plant potatoes here. Plant uh, oak trees. Nice big old sturdy, hardy oak trees. Works for me. Low food. You're full of crap, game. We're fine on food. Just nobody's hauling it right now. Starvation. Can you please stop? You're going to starve yourself to death. You big baby. <laughs> Don't make me euthanize you. I'll do it. Got my eye on you. Yeah, there you go. That's what I thought. You better. All right. How are we doing down here? Slowly getting there. How are we doing on... Uh, steel. We're still doing okay on steel. It's just gonna take a long time. Basically, only one per person working on it. Marina is, uh, is working on it. Texane should be. He spends a lot of time cooking. We don't have any, like, real good cook either. I don't know if any of these guys are good at cooking. I think some of them can't even do it. Uh, you have a three. You have, you can't do it. You have a six. That's not bad. I think that's actually better. Melissa, you're going to be a little useful. Maybe, uh, you know, the dumb labor thing isn't too big of a deal with you. I'll just have you being cook, you know, cooking all the time and things like that. Pork has rotted away in storage. That is unfortunate. Someday when we get all this power done, hopefully, then I can, uh, I can do something with that. Make sure it doesn't rot away. All right. Uh, mine all this. Just keep mining. Make sure we have plenty of stuff to uh, to handle this. Also, kill all these... I God, they're just... They're like multiplying. Every time I set one to hunt, because nobody's hunting them right now, I'm just getting more and more of them. Okay, how's everybody doing as far as weapons and such? Alright, you're all good. Yep. We don't have any more ranged weapons, do we? No. That's a problem. We have a spear. That's pretty cool. Get away from my house. 
Ibex, just go away. Also, this body. Like, get rid of this body. Can you go bury this body? Bury him. Stop farting around. It's gross. So people stop looking at it. They get all pissed off about it. <laughs> Ew, there's a corpse. You big babies. <laughs> I have like 300 things selected to be hunted. Look, look at this. They're eating my food. Get, oh, that's my cat. Yeah, don't shoot my cat. I would be very displeased with the shooting of the cat. All right. Come on, recruit. Recruit them. How you feeling? Hideous environment. Yeah, that'll do it. Um, I can actually work on that a little. What if I put wood flooring in here? Do you guys like wood flooring? Wood flooring's pretty, right? There's no beauty to it. What about paved tiles? Paved tile ugly? No. Concrete's ugly, though. Yeah, concrete's lower beauty. Sterile tile? No. No silver. Metal tile. It's got beauty. Labor intensive. And material intensive. How much would this cost? Holy crap, 280. Psychic drone. That sucks. That sucks a lot. Um, we have these as well. We have 70 granite blocks. I think this would be really pretty, right? Yeah. 70, though. That's not enough. It's not even close. You guys might just have to stick to wood. It's probably going to be prettier than that, though. Right? Because the dirt floor is probably really gross. But I'm already sitting in here. That's also it, too. I can see how dirty it is. There's no cleaning. Why'd you eat that? Where is Texane? Texane, what are you doing, man? Oops. I did not want to build that there. What are you doing? You're consuming berries. Cook food. Did I take you away from cooking? No. You're hunting. Why? Why aren't you cooking? Oh my god. Refuel it. It's not rocket science, man. Put the wood in the thing. All right. Refill it all the way. There, now cook. Don't be stupid. All right. Oh, somebody's going to be really bummed out. They got berries and the other person got... <laughs> McTodd got the meal. Wah, wah. All right, how's this environment look to you now? Still hideous. It's probably because it's dirty. Can you clean? You can. All right, uh, Texane, you're cooking. Cooking is actually really important right now. Leaf, can you clean? Go clean. What? Oh, new recruit. Booyah, Melissa. Melissa, welcome to the party. The joy wire. You can't do dumb labor. No hauling, cleaning, or research, or plant cutting. But you can do hunting. You can do construction. You can do smithing, tailoring, crafting. Yeah, that's all good. You could even be a, a secondary doctor if needed. It's not necessary, but... You can also cook. You actually have some skill in it and some desire to do it. You're actually a better animal handler. Well, no, you guys are equal. I'll have you guys both do that, but you'll be our cook. Texane can do other things. In fact, you're probably a better hunter too, huh? 11. What is your shooting? 11. Oh, yeah. Um, sorry, you've been demoted, Texane. There you go. Um, and Texane, don't worry about hunting. You worry about construction and mining and stuff like that. Works for me. Um, how's your, how's your, oh, yeah, you're good at melee too. Perfect. Um, you can grab this steel club, normal. That'll be your weapon of choice. Actually, no, 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 the spear. Grab the spear. Sorry, I keep waking you. My bad. Go back to sleep. How you doing, Leaf? All right, you're, you're pretty rested. Go clean. 
Make these people a little happier. I think it'll make it easier for me to... No, no, no. No, you're not done yet. Man, you clean fast. I wish I could just lock you in this room to clean. Just clean. Keep cleaning. I'm faster than you. No, get back here. Oh, wait, you're trying to eat, huh? Oh, yeah, here, you go eat. All right, now... Oh, you're gonna go for a walk. That's fine. I kind of took up a lot of your time. Hopefully that room's a little better now. All right. Party. Melissa's throwing a party. Nice. You guys actually that happy? That's awesome. She's throwing a party at the, at the horseshoes. Uh, Marlu of the stream have arrived nearby. They're attacking immediately. Oh, bows. Bows could be dangerous. Alright. Well, I already have a plan for this. It's the same plan I've used before. We'll let them get in a little closer. Let everybody enjoy their party a little bit. Alright. Now's the time. Leaf, you're gonna go over here. Melissa, you're gonna go over here. And I'm missing somebody. Texane, you're going to go over here. Oh, nice shot right through there. That's beautiful. All right, you're going to run up behind and attack him. There we go. Texane, get in there. You two are going to go up to this edge. All right. Oh, they're running. Get a shot off on him. Yeah, that'll teach him. <laughs> Nice shot in the hand. That'll remind you to not come back. Ooh, and the arm. Wow, you're a pretty good shot with a pistol. It's real, real impressive. All right, strip this body. We'll take the club. Continue with your party. You're still throwing a party, right? The psychic drone is annoying, but nobody's like majorly upset. That's pretty good. Yeah, they're still throwing a party. Um, you should probably go lay in on bed, man. In fact, let's make sure we got some more beds. Put two more here. That makes for uh, six total. One of those would be a um, hospital bed. That's what we'll end up doing. Party's finished. All right, Leaf. Um, Marina will handle you in a moment. Uh, what, how are you looking? You just got a bruise. Just a little bruise, actually. You don't really need much worry about that at the moment. You're fine. Oh, don't, don't, don't worry about it, Marina. He's not going to get a freaking disease from a club or from a bruise. Just give him herbal meds for this one. And I'll switch him back. All right, now I'll switch him back. Yeah, it's literally just a bruise. It's not a big deal. We'll keep the good stuff for a later time. I really wish people would take all this stuff and put it away. Oh man, all this medicine is rotting. It spoils in two years. In one season. Okay, it's gonna take a while. Still though. <sighs> a lot of minor break risks. Bouncing in and out. We got chairs to sit at. Hey, Marina's sitting down having a beer. Nice. Cargo pods, where you at? Perhaps I'll find something useful. I found a bunch of limestone. Awesome. Maybe I can make my walls look a little prettier. That would be pretty swell. All this food just going to waste. So who does the growing? Leaf. Why haven't you been growing, man? Or did you just do this? You must have just done this. Yeah, you're, you're doing this right now. Okay. All right, then. Need warm clothes. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I gotta start really thinking about the future here. Hmm. Alright, well, a lot of time progress at two speed while I do some planning here. Um, so if I run a hallway... How would I run this? Hmm. Oops. Ah, screwed up right away. All right, let's plan here. 
Do I want to do three wide hallway, like a primary main hallway down the middle? Like this or something? I don't know about that. Maybe I should just do one wide. Maybe I don't need to like freak out about the width. It looks like just tiny though. And two wide, the, the, there's no double doors. It's really annoying. It's like one or three. One's too small, three's too big. Two is perfect, but there's no double door. Uh. Hmm. Could also build into this mountain. Some. It's not not a bad option. I could build like the the food and stuff out here, and everything else can go inside. And if I did, where would I put the entrance? If I did something like this, just go like uh, thirty back. Oh, that's four. I don't want four wide. I want a three wide. There we go. That's our main hallway. And then we just cut it back this way and the other way. Do another 30 from here. 30 from here. It's a lot of mining. Hmm. That allow us to build in all directions. Um, and then I could make big old seven by seven rooms if I want. That's an option. You can even go the other way with it too and have them on this side <clears throat> as well. Holy crap, all this mining. This is all just planning. I'm not actually doing any of this yet and I don't even know if this is what I want to do. But I want, I want to have larger rooms for people. That is true. That's 12 rooms right there. That's more colonists than I've ever had. So that, that could almost like set me up right there. I could continue this on this direction. I could add another one on the other side if I want to. I can make that work. And then over here, I can do a bunch of... Uh, seven by seven rooms, I guess. And these can all be like different... Uh, you know, uh, various things that people need to do, like... You know... Different crafts and whatnot. I could do that. Run this through here. Something like that. Hmm. Mad animal. That's a problem. It's a boar, too. It's not like a squirrel. All right. Let's grab everybody. Take care of this mad animal real quick. All right. You guys know the drill. Melissa, you're going to go back here. Marina, you're going to go right here. Thankfully, you guys are the... the close-up ones with the guns. Uh, these guys, hopefully they'll get there in time. Nope, they're not going to. Alright, well, you're gonna just run and straight up melee attack. Then, because you're gonna be a little far away. Um, you guys take a couple pot shots. Alright, back up. Alright, no, 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 no. See, because you're gonna, you're gonna stab him in the, you're gonna shoot him in the back. Don't do that. Just run over here. Alright, we're good? We're good. Um, don't rescue the boar. Melee attack the boar to death. There we go. Everyone's good. So yeah, what about that? Is that, that a good idea? It leaves me with tons of rooms. I got. I mean, it's not like I don't have enough room to build. I might find some nice stuff in here as well. It's going to take a while to mine all this. But let's start by mining this part. This part. This part these rooms. It's going to take a while. <laughs> it's going to take a real long time. It's a lot of work. But I think in the end, it might be a, a way to go. I might be able to just push everything indoors at that point. If I, you know, get long enough in there. And then I can just use this outside. It's just defensive. I can keep this as like my, my power plant, essentially. I can run like a little thin hallway. You know, and, and put like a wall at the end of it and just run the wires 
into there. There's a lot of little things I could do. I could replace these walls at some point as well. I could like start cutting out the walls and putting up, you know, wood or something, something else, basically. That could work. What are you doing? Oh, okay, you're playing horseshoes. All right. You're hauling steel to a solar generator. We still haven't finished this? Jeez. Jeez, guys. Visiting a grave. All right. Um, that body's yep, being stripped. Good. I'm really bummed that these boomalopes are nice and close. That's fun. I'll make this bed medical. For now. Alright. How many people do we have mining? A lot. And quite a few of them are really good, too. So once we get the construction and stuff out of the way, a lot of these people will go to mining. Um, I think the only one is working is because he doesn't have construction. Yeah. He does growing and mining. He's good at it. Ooh, hey, look at that. Got some compacted steel. Beautiful. That's real good. At some point, we're going to need to be doing research as well. Hmm. I think it's a good idea, though. I think moving inside... Last one I did was outside, and, you know, it was good. It did fine. Um, this would actually work as well. I just have to make everything a little smaller. Maybe push this all back or somewhere else. Maybe put it down here. And just kind of work with this area. But I think building into this mountain might be a good idea. Especially since I'm finding some stuff, too. It's not all bad. It's going to take a while. And the other thing, too, is that this is going to be extremely dirty because of all this rubble. And he's going to be very pissed off about how hideous the environment is. Once that very intended party goes away, it's going to be a real problem. So I'm hoping cleaning is also something that people do. Once all the hauling and everything else is done. I should probably have somebody just not haul and instead clean. But, nah. Just so much to do, though. And neither one of these guys can do dumb labor, can they? Um, character. No dumb labor. McTodd can. Okay. Maybe I'll make McTodd be like a designated cleaner instead of hauler. Just you clean. In fact, maybe I'll just make him clean to start. Because there's all this blood and stuff everywhere. Maybe his job will just be clean. Clean everything. And then once everything's nice and clean, then I'll start turning some other stuff on. That's probably a good idea. Right? I think so. We've already made some decent progress, too. Surprisingly. Uh, another raid. Holy crap. These raids are happening very often. You guys attacking right away? Yeah, you are. You go straight for the solar generator. You're going to have to go all the way around for that. I'll let these guys sleep for a bit. Let them get some sleep. How are your needs? Oh, I can see sleep right here. Okay. Oh my god, that was fast. Um, yeah, get out here. Um, you guys. Oh crap, they're gonna go attack my stuff. No! It went from one speed to three speeds super quick. Alright. Stop. Melee attack. Melee attack. And you guys, shoot Pezza in the back. Go fire at Pezza. Stop it. That's very expensive. It's, it's going to take me a while to rebuild if you make me rebuild it. Yeah, how are you going to get out now, you little bastard? Oh, you're going to run down that way. Yeah, I forgot about that. <laughs> All right. Hey, uh, Bren the Scout. Incapable of carrying or firefighting. Man, you have some good skills. All right. Um, we have three positions, so hey, welcome to the club. Um, do you have any weapons or anything on you? No, you just have tribal wear. Okay, well I won't, I won't take off your tribal wear, but uh, yeah. All right, you guys can go back to doing other things. Major break, Melissa. Yeah, you need probably need to eat. Would be my guess, or sleep. What are you doing? You want to sleep? Your sleep is full. Oh, I guess you need some sleep. Alcohol withdrawal. Fun. Feeling shaky. Everything pisses me off. I need a drink. Well, I mean, we have go juice. Is that like drinking? Okay, so the withdrawal is going to go super bad. And then it's going to go away. You know, maybe she's going to kick the habit after it hits 20%. But the, as it gets worse and worse, she's going to get more and more. 
negative effects, essentially. She's probably going to break more than once, would be my guess. That might be a, a thing that needs to happen, though. All right, Bren. How are you doing? 77. That's pretty bad, but I'll give you um, herbal meds. I hope we didn't already heal you. Oh, we did. Never mind. All right. Well, whatever. <laughs> oh, man. I don't think I can get to that wood. Solar flare. It doesn't matter. We don't have any electrical devices right now, so. <laughs> Shooting squirrels in the kitchen. <clears throat> Anybody cooking? Who's the cook? Melissa. What are you doing? You're hunting. Is hunting more important than cooking? No. Why aren't you cooking? Oh, it's because we're out of fuel. Uh, we're out of fuel. You put fuel in the damn stove. Thank you. That should be like a major fucking priority. <laughs> no fuel in the stove? Go put fuel in the stove. That should be up there with flick. You know? It's one of those things where when you want it done, do it. If it needs to be done, just do it. Otherwise, we're going to sit here and not cook meals for some reason. Melissa. All right, cool. That should make you happy. Yeah, it's coming back up. How's everybody else doing? You're content. You're neutral. You're content. You're still stressed. It's probably, yeah, the alcohol addiction. I'm going to tell you. I don't have any. I have no alcohol to give you. All right. Well, we're starting to move in indoors, like literally into the mountain. <laughs> um... Hopefully it works. It seems like it would. If so, I mean, I like I said, I all all these rooms, I could expand this direction or this direction if I want to. I can make these a bunch of things. I can maybe move the kitchen and such here. Um, there's a lot I could do. Actually, the kitchen should probably be closer to the outside. I'd probably put it here with maybe like the um, the freezer here so that it can get, you know, it needs to have a source to, to output the uh, the heat from the exhaust. So, that might work. Otherwise, it may be down here, too. But yeah, our little, our little place is doing well. Everybody's okay. Um, they're all pretty much content. She's stressed out because of her alcohol addiction. She's had a pretty heavy, heavy withdrawal. Not a lot I can do about it, though. I don't have any alcohol, and frankly, you should probably kick the habit if you're addicted. Um, yeah. <laughs> so, that's going to do it for this episode. I hope you enjoyed it. I look forward to seeing you in the next one. I've been Chaotic Order, and I will see you next time.